Of all the tech reviews I do, there's one thing I haven't done. Shoes. What is the best shoe on the market for your golf in 2018? It's this one. The Footjoy Pro SL has been on the market for many years now and ever since they came on the market, I've wore them. Not because I think they look good, although they do, and not because they're the most comfortable, but they are. Purely because they are all round the best shoe I've ever worn. And I'm aware how much of a big statement that is. So what are we wanting from a new golf shoe? The Footjoy Pro SL offers not only unbelievable looks, you also get a perimeter weighted sole which gives you a lot more stability through any golf shot you're going to play. Who doesn't want a perimeter weighted sole? In this model I also get a beautiful red heel not only does it match the shirt at the moment but also it's red for Manchester United. I know I probably just lost half my subscribers but it is nice to have the red heel. As you've probably seen on some of my other videos, I've worn the Pro SL for quite a long time. How does it help my golf? Let's get outside and let's see just how this shoe helps my golf. So just as we walk into the first tee, let's have a bit of a discussion. What's the best golf shoe you've ever worn? Obviously I'm thinking the foot joy pro sells for myself i'm well aware that it's a personal thing i'm sure some of you guys are sat there screaming at your phone screen or your ipad screen or your laptop screen or your tv screen but nice if you're watching on your tv screen and saying i wear adidas i've always wore adidas i think adidas are fantastic good for you if you think they're good comment below let me know what the best shoe is you've ever worn So I guess this video is a bit of fun, I mean, yes it is, it generally is the best golf shot I've ever wore, ever worn, my mum would kill me. Now I suppose a, a serious part of this is, is with the sizes of foot joy, anybody, any golfer will tell you, in the Adidas I'm a size 11, I know right, whereas in foot joy, these are nine and a half, and I've kind of staggered every time I've got foot joy and every time I've got these pro SLs. I've staggered down size and I guess it's kind of how, how low do you dare go. I still think, you know, I could maybe squeeze a nine, whereas if I try a ten and a half in Adidas, I'm not making it round 18 holes. So not that it even means that much anymore because let's face it, all the brands just pay the players whatever they want. You have players like Adam Scott, Louis Oosthuizen, Beef, all wearing the Pro SLs. And you know it's a really strange one because when the Pro SL first came out, the market was screaming for a spikeless shoe which had the stability of a proper golf shoe. And voila, here it is. Okay, I'm going to put this back on now because they must have had the sprinkles on here and I've got a wet foot now.
Also, anybody who aim points, these shoes are fantastic for feeling even the smallest percentage difference. Another plus point. Right there, everyone, I hope you've enjoyed that little, I suppose you could call it a review of the Footjoy Pro SL shoes. If you haven't tried them, at least go try them on in your pro shop. You'll not be disappointed and you'll probably find yourself parting with at least a hundred and what are they now? 125 pounds maybe? That's probably a really good price actually, don't quote me on that one. So if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. I hope you're enjoying the content so far if you're not new to the channel. And I'm going to leave you with this tricky up and down out the bunker. Let's see if I can get up and down wearing the new Foot Drive Pro SLs. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs>